Plumber Tom here. The video that you are about to watch is a short excerpt from a course that I have all about drainage, waste, and vents. The difference between plumbers who know what they are doing and those who do not is whether they understand drainage, waste, and vent principles. This course is designed to help you to understand all of that and to become a true master of the trade. So check it out. There's a link below. You can enroll in the course. I hope to see you there. All right, let's examine the basic requirements for wet vents. Vertical wet vent principle one, a wet vent can serve up to two bathroom groups. Please note that a wet vent is limited to bathroom group fixtures. The definition for a bathroom group is given in the International Plumbing Code chapter two. It states that a bathroom group is a group of fixtures consisting of a water closet, lavatory, bathtub or shower, including or excluding a bidet and emergency floor drain or both. Such fixtures are located together on the same floor level. This definition restricts the wet vent to bathroom fixtures only. Other nearby fixtures like laundry sinks, washer drains, kitchen sinks, things like that, should be connected downstream around the wet vented bathroom group fixtures. Vertical wet vent principle two. The drain pipe is also considered a vent pipe from the dry vent connection down to the lowest fixture drain connection. This means that the drain is serving both as a drain and a vent. Vertical wet vent principle three. All fixtures connected to the wet vent must be on the same floor level as we learned in definition. Vertical wet vent principle four. Each fixture must connect independently to the wet vent or the section of pipe that is being considered both a drain and a vent. Vertical wet vent principle five. Toilets shall connect on the same elevation when they're connected to a wet vent. Vertical wet vent principle six. A dry vent connection can be an individual vent or a common vent. And vertical wet vent principle seven. Fixtures other than toilets shall be connected above the toilet connection. Or in other words, the toilet should be the lowest on a vertical wet vent. This is to prevent siphoning of other fixtures when the toilet flushes. 